guys, today we are going to be doing some simple magic tricks that might not fool some people, but they also might fool people. These are for like younger kids that will fool younger kids. So like older kids fool younger kids, you know. The first one is this one. There's your card right there. And then you put it back in the deck. And when you pick it up again, it's magically a different number. Are you going to tell them how it happens? Yes, I will. So this one is very simple. While they're not looking, you're going to grab two cards like that. And you're going to line them up perfectly so that you don't see any other card. And then, so you have your four. Now you put it back in the deck. You're going to come up with the one card only. So whatever's on the bottom you show, then you put them again, them. and whatever's on the top you pull. But you make sure you Another you're... one, this is very simple. You're going through, when they say stop... They can't see. So you're going through like this, and when they and when your person says stop, stop. say they stop right there, so your deck is, looks like this. Say you're going to guess the card, and what you're going to do is you're going to pretend to like riffle it up like this. And you're going to real quick look at it. And then the card that you rippled up, you see it, and you say it's a 7. And they'll be like, how did you do that? Okay, my water bottle trick shot thing is in the way. Uh, another one. This one's kind of weird. So, so just tell them to choose any card. Say they choose this card. You're going to put your deck like this. When you put the card back in, make sure that you see where the card is placed. So by doing that, you might leave it hanging it out a little bit. Like this. You know, might have it hanging out a little bit. You might have it down here. Like this. And then they'll be like, oh, you must have just not have pushed the cards in. So then you shuffle it up. Then you'll be like, okay. So I don't know where your card is. Then you're going to shuffle it. But make sure that that card stays down. I just messed it all up. But then say it, it's still down and that's their card, you know. It's like that. And then I think my last trick you're going to tell them to pick a card. Wait. Yeah, tell them to pick a card like this. So let's pick this card. You're going to flip the deck over like... Ah. This. And then real quickly, you're going to take this card and flip it over like that. And then you're going to take their card... And they're going to think, oh, because that card's like that, they're going to put their card in like that. I'm going to push it in. And I'm going to say, behind my back, I'm going to find your card. You just flip this top card back over like that. You bring it back out, and you'll be like, somehow, magically, your card has been flipped over the ace. But if you really want to trick them somehow... Do not, do not put it behind your back because that might say, "Oh, you put the, you put it behind your back, so that means you must." Yeah, have but you're not something. looking back there. Oh yeah, but you still can use your hands. Okay, guys, this is my three uploads in one day. So my third one. It's about eight o'clock at night or something. I might post again for another really short vlog, but I'll see what time it is. It's...